There we go. Tier 3 is done. Tier 4, well, all of it will need to come in some other way. And I don't think our missions are going to give us enough for that. All we have are these four. And so, Cappy Rock. I think I just want to knock that out. I mean, this one is so annoying. Okay, uh, we're just gonna get rid of Lil Ch We already landed 300 tons on Duna. This this one is sort of an insult by comparison, right? <laughs> let's let's take that Duna mission and see what how we can lessen it to do 200 tons on Minmus. And just get that done quickly, just because otherwise it's just hanging out there forever. I don't need that 28 science, but just don't want it in the list anymore. Should we? Well, pa parachutes down here aren't going to help. I just want to manage this with fewer boosters, basically. These were dangerous anyway. I think we should shorten this up. I don't know... Oh, well, it's got the Separatrons, though. Let's not shorten it up, then. I'm just going to reduce the fuel so that we have more thrust weight ratio. Oh, that says... Oh, that's because there's two... Why did two end up on a different stage when I, they're all in symmetry? I think it'll work out. I just want to do it quickly. Big Minmus mission. Is this good? Am I doing something horribly wrong here? Okay, so let's not do the boat launch. Let's clear everything else. Huh. The Bill snuck on board. Fine. Okay. Let's just get daylight. Up we go to land 200 tons on... Oh, that's not good. Um, I can't get to the launch escape system. Oh, shoot. I don't suppose Bill's around here somewhere. Um, I think launch escape systems should be automated. Oh, you know what it is? It's because it doubled up the launch clamps and put them in here. Ah, uh, I only wanted them to have the eight-way symmetry on the outside. I'm just, that's just silly. I'm just gonna revert that. Well, that, that one, I don't blame KSP24 in particular, I should have been more attentive, but of course they were hidden. Can't see, but I mean, I, there's 16 there obviously, it should be 8. Okay, now we've only got 8, and uh, you know what, Bill, maybe it's safer for you not to go. We've got a controller on here, it's fine. We'll just turn that into a depot or rescue ship or something later. Still swaying. <laughs> okay. Okay, here we go. With 100% less Kerbal. Uh, maybe I've turned a little bit too quickly here. Oops. Well, we're past the speed of sound. The skippers are a bit OP for... for Minmus, though. Could have gone with a lighter engine.
Okay, well, launch escape system jettison, I think. Okay. Oh, maybe it's too early and the core will overheat, though. Hmm. It's alright, we're actually going slower now? <laughs> so, hmm. Didn't recall that this was such a leisurely stage. Um, would it be better with just with the skippers? I, I, I'm trying to stage. I can't stage. Oh, time warp. Its thrust weight ratio ain't great either. Okay, okay, this is a bust. Turns out those boosters might have been necessary. Well, I think we can reconfigure it somewhat. I think we should maybe try and land this? I don't know. Maybe I should focus on, like, the vertical part and let drag do the rest. No, oh, no, no, don't go pointing for... No, no, don't go pointing in first. Okay, take it back. Let's just go retrograde. We're not a uh, thrust weight ratio of one yet. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna work very well. Eek. Well, we tried. <laughs> Technically, we could recover the capsule, but whatever. We didn't pay for it. Oh! Oh! Even better! Submarine! Very submarine. I think it's still sinking, so... Okay! We have, uh, once again created a submarine. We're just gonna leave this be. Uh, I guess we can recover a vessel. Okay. Like we want remnants of that disaster. But anyway, let us rethink this. The Rhino clearly was not the solution. Let's just put another mammoth. I don't understand what it's trying to tell me about the Delta V, because it seems to me this Delta V should be up here after the boosters separate. Or, yeah, I, it does, it's not telling me the right thing, I don't think. But we'll have thrust weight ratio, so let's try that. Oh no, please tell me no Kerbal snuck on board. Bill! Oh, now that we have thrust weight ratio, we can fill up the tanks. Let's do that. Eh, maybe we should just leave it be. But no bill. No bill. Um... One of the little... Skipper pods just fell off. And... What did we learn, really? Let's try that again. Tell me. Tell me what we learned. Okay, before anything bad happens... Why does it seem like the fuel is reversed? I... We had... Underdone all the... Lower tanks. But it only has one that's underfueled. Great. That's why it's sort of sidestepping too, because there's an imbalance in the fuels. I duplicated the same tank, but it filled the duplicates up. But not the one that I was holding. So we'll have one go out first. Let's just hope that we're high enough so that doesn't matter too much. There we go, that one. Uh, I think the rest can hold it, hopefully. Hopefully. Okay, maybe maybe I should just switch off this one. Okay, off they go. Okay. 
And we're actually still accelerating, yay. Very important, as we found out. Oh, uh, sound. You know what, let's wait until we get to Apoapsis. Okay, let's get rid of the launch escape system now that we're out of the atmosphere. Alright. 10x even. Okay, that's a little bit lopsided, but... So is Mrs. Orbit, so it's fine. No, I'm... <laughs> get me a target. Okay. We'll just do an off-plane transfer. The moon's messing with us. Okay. Moon, periapsis, and then Minmus periapsis. <laughs> Let's hope that all works out. Just don't crash into either one, please. Okay, I, I'm g just gonna try it. We'll fix it later. Okay, separation, ignition, and we continue. I think some warp will be good here. Um, in this periapsis. So it looks like we're avoiding the moon, actually. Okay, I'll just take that. Okay, node please. 382, is that 82 or 62? Maybe, let's just pretend it's 62 just in case. And we need 200 tons on Minmus. Okay, let's go over there, whatever our periapsis happens to be. Out we go. Don't think from Minmus range I need the antenna out, but hey. We have an antenna around here somewhere, so... We should have enough Delta V. I'd like to pass by on the daylight side, actually. And just land directly. It's almost at a flat. But right now, uh, Minmus will rotate, so we can't really tell. Okay, let's get closer. Hmm, K? What have we got? No, oh, the flats are still there. Um, so why don't we just go up into it? Well, we're probably going to get 300 tons of Minmus. Oh, maybe not. We'll see. Anyway, 200 tons should be a definite. Got a lot of thrust weight ratio. Uh, too much. Very much OP for Minmus. Oh, it hopped! It hopped! No, don't do that. Gosh darn it. It hopped again. <laughs> it's now a Minmus pogo stick. Come on, they're not gonna count it. Just under 300 tons, by the way. Oh no, you don't. No, no. Come on. Come on. Come on. RCS. Okay, it counts it as landed now. Please just stay stable. 
Yeah, 299.13 tons. Just under 300, but we only need to do 200 here. But anyway, all right. They are satisfied in theory. Let's go to mission control. Yes, done. Uh, 200 ton, ton hunk of metal drop kick gravity to force itself. Okay, whatever you say. Barreling down like an extinction, extinction, extinction level event. Yeah, 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 yeah. Squeeze it until one of us explodes. <laughs> strange. Okay, no new mission as a result of that. So, all right, I think I'll wrap it up here for this time. Next time we will try something different. Uh, we'll see which planet we are aligned with in order to decide where we go to. But for now, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.